the standard DC to DC converter is available in predefined output voltages such as 3.3, 5, 12, 15, etc. Many converter manufacturers give the designer the ability to program or adjust the output voltage. This is usually done via a control pin on the DC to DC converter. The control pin can be adjusted with fixed resistors, potentiometers, or other circuits such as uh, D to A converters or op amps. By trimming the DC to DC converter, the designer can create non-standard output voltages. The set point can be trimmed up or down as the application needs. The designer can also vary the voltage during operation. This can be done by feeding a voltage to the control pin via an op amp or a D to A converter. The converter can also be used as a voltage controlled current source, where the voltage is dynamically adjusted to control the current in such applications as a battery charger. It's important to note that many DC to DC converters have a maximum power rating and a maximum current set point. So when you trim up the DC to DC converter, the designer has to limit the current so as not to exceed the power rating of the module. And when you trim down the DC to DC converter, the power rating is minimized by the percentage trimmed down. In applications where you need more power or more current, you can parallel DC to DC converters or you can have a converter design for the maximum power and maximum current for the application. Vicor has an online design program where the designer can specify his own input range, output voltage, power rating, and current rating for the application. In this example, we have a Vicor 12 volt 200 watt mini module that's set for 12 volts. And let's say the application needs 9 volts. We can use the Vicor online calculator to put in 9 volts with a mini converter and the calculator gives us a resistor value of 3K. With the same DC to DC converter, if we wanted to trim the output voltage from 12 up to 13.2, we can again use the online calculator to set the voltage to 13.2 and it will calculate a resistor value of 96.32K. To trim up the DC to DC converter, we can add a fixed resistor between the positive sense pin and the SC pin. And now the output voltage is set to 13.2 volts. Here we have a 24 volt to 12 volt DC to DC converter operating at one amp. To trim the voltage to nine volts, we add a fixed resistor to, from the SC pin to the minus S pin. With the resistor in place, now the output voltage is set to 9 volts. The online design calculator can also be used for a variable trim. It will give you resistor values for the potentiometer and the fixed resistor values as shown in the diagram. With a variable trimming network, we can adjust the voltage from a higher voltage down to a lower voltage. With a variable trim, the output can be adjusted from a higher voltage down to a lower voltage. We can drive the SC pin with an external voltage source to adjust the output voltage as well. By feeding a voltage to the SC pin with this op amp, we can raise or lower the voltage. The Vicor DC to DC converter can also be used as a constant current source for battery charging applications or LED drivers. We have an application note on our website, Constant Current Control for DC to DC Converters.